electrical components are not easy to store because they're so small and there's so many different kinds of them. So let me show you the system that I use. So we have these, these little bags that just have a 3x5 note card in them uh, printed on a label of what everything is. You know, transistors have pretty little pictures with the stripes of what color they are. Uh, to make it easier to see. It's also labeled on the top of the bag. Um, and then they're just sorted. You know, this goes from one ohm up to, you know, about 150, and then from, from go to the next one over from 180 to like 4.7K and all the way to your mega ohm resistors. And whenever you want to get uh, like a 47 K or something, it's pretty easy to you get familiar with the system and that's where they're at. And it works from more than just resistors. I mean, we have voltage regulators sorted by what voltage they uh, drop to. Uh, we have various types of integrated circuits. These you may not be able to sort the same way, but you can put op amps with op amps and such, diodes, capacitors, even fuses sorted by their rated amperage. And at any time you can add in a new bag and just, you know, drop in, let's say I have 4.7 microfarad and 22, let's say I get a 10 microfarad bag, I could put that right in there. This is a system that I use and that I think it makes prototyping boards a lot quicker.